Hello, today we're going to talk about how to turn on the Windows subsystem for Linux or WSL in Windows 10. So we start off here in an administrative PowerShell prompt and we're going to go ahead and enter this command. It's enable Windows optional feature with the online flag and the feature name is Microsoft Windows subsystem Linux with dashes separating those. So let's go ahead and run that. Now this is going to usually prompt you to restart. I've done this in advance for the demo, so I don't have to, but you will have to restart at this step. Now let's head over and see what we can do. Okay, so I've restarted my computer. I've run the uh, Windows fe feature command, and now I can actually go ahead and install my Linux distribution. So if you open the Microsoft Store, these Linux distributions are going to run as Windows Store apps, which is a little bit weird to get used to at first, but trust me, it works. So go ahead and open up the Microsoft Store and type in WSL, and this page should come up. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and get Ubuntu for this purpose. See, I've already installed it here, but I can just get it like a normal Windows app and then launch it from here as well. Let's go ahead and do that. All right, so now that my Ubuntu app is up and running, I can go ahead and initialize it. It's going to ask you to do the standard username and password setup, which I've done already. And now we can get started with uh, using it. All right, there we go. Thanks for watching.